Hey everybody, Steve Chase here. I'm in QuickBooks Online and I'm going to share with you how to generate a statement for your customer and discover how to send that out to them. Okay, so the first thing you might get tripped up about would be to go to reports and search for statement. <clears throat> Just get this statement list and uh, this is the statement list report not what we want to at least start off with. Instead, when you want to create a statement, you can find it two ways. Um, you can either find it when you go to that customer. So imagine I'm under um, one Fibonacci. I could go here. I can see that they do have an open balance of 20K. And I could click the drop down right next to new transaction and select statement. Okay, and then once I'm in here, where the options are balance forward, open item transaction statements here. So I'm going to just do uh, balance forward, my statement date, April 8th. And then I need to know how, kind of how far back I want to date this. If I go back January 1, let's say, apply. Okay. And there we go. So there is an option to email them the statement here. But first, um, let me go ahead and save that. OK, so one statement successfully created. All right, let me go back to reports, type statement list. And there we have the one Fibonacci there, which I could run it here to see the details of that statement here. Okay, so that's uh, could be really handy as you're working on different things to kind of whittle down and kind of see. All right, so I could just quickly jump into something here, take a look to see the payment applied there. Okay, all right. Um, the alternative way would be to do a print preview of that statement. So if I was back in here, I come down to print preview. This is what we're looking at here. As we see there, okay. All right, let me show you another example here. Let's imagine that the other way I went about it is I went to new and selected statement. Now, what this will do is it will show um, all the available statements. So at this point, I'm going to see how we have six statements available as of today I would need to make sure that I want you know where do I want to start I'll go back to, let's go back uh, to November 1 apply <clears throat> this is just recognizing that um, there's no email here but really that produced seven uh, statements there okay and I'll just simply um, hit print or print preview Okay, so here, here's everybody's statements here. Pretty cool. So ideally, though, if you're going to get out of there, ideally, if you were only interested in one particular one, um, for example, let's say I was interested in just uh, one Fibonacci here, then I could go into Print Preview. Take a look at it right there. Okay, that's awesome. So that's basically it. And then from here, when you have it, you would do save and send for that particular customer here. And it would give you a quick preview before you actually hit the sent button. I would be going to our, our buddy Lucas Pacioli. Don't know who that is. Look him up. All right. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'm Steve Chase. Stay tuned for more videos. Um, and check out supporting the videos that you see here by hitting the like or subscribe button. It really does help uh, promote the channel and helps um, allow other people like you to see videos like this that you're interested in. Thank you.